for this I came to Paris for this image look at that oh my god look how nice is this cafe restaurant here let me show you the prices the flame of liberty it's a full-size replica of the flame of the torch from the statue of liberty in uh, new york and became an unofficial memorial for diana princess of wales after her uh, death in the tunnel beneath this is my calzone my god look look at the size of it it's huge look how much cheese it's inside our hotel it's very close from the train station this one Lumiere we're going to use the underground now the metro let's see what the prices are so we take the nine single journey the price is uh, 17 uh, euro okay. i have no idea how uh, to get from here to eiffel tower go to republic train station i mean underground station and from over there I will see because over there it's like an uh, important uh, train point. So this is uh, how the train looks uh, on the subway looks here in uh, Paris. The first thing I will want to see here in Paris is of course the Eiffel Tower. It's uh, easy to get lost here. Yeah? Ah, that direction, okay. This image it's, uh, is fantastic with Seine River and uh, Eiffel Tower in the back. Amazing. For this, I came to Paris. For this image, look at that. Oh my god. I have a gas bomb. My god. Tomorrow we have uh, tickets on the second floor. Uh, when I do the bookings, all of them with the elevator, with the lift, was uh, sold out. So only option was uh, by stairs. <laughs> now when I'm looking how high is it, I think I have no chance to go until the second floor by stairs. I understand there are about uh, 600 or over steps. Here you can buy some crepes, you can buy juice if you want. And uh, we have a couple of more guys around who they sell some alcoholic drinks, wine, beer. The construction of the tower started in uh, 1887. It was completed in uh, 1889 on the uh, 15th of March and uh, on the 31st of March it was uh, open to the public. I think uh, the high is uh, around uh, 300 meters and it has until the second floor more than uh, 600 steps. Look at this tree, it's perfectly square. On the other side, in the distance, you can see the Grand Palais Infemers and uh, the Montparnasse Tower, the tall building, that one. It's a nice atmosphere here. How cool uh, it is to sit on the grass here and, uh, and have a drink. With this... Uh, amazing view of the Eiffel Tower now we're going to to eat something look how nice is this cafe restaurant here at the corner right next to the Eiffel Tower let me show you the prices 
Yeah, that's extraordinary. So we are now on the Avenue Rep. <laughs> Here on the corner, we have uh, another beautiful uh, Italian French restaurant. Uh, let's try this one, Cafe Pizzeria. These are the prices. So we choose to stop here at the Cantina di Luca. Probably when uh, we're going to eat some pizza. Huh? Those are the prices. We're going with uh, two pizza. One calzone, which is uh, 17. And one Regina, which is uh, 16 euro. And probably we're going to order two beers, which is uh, it's about eight euro each. This is how this uh, restaurant looks inside. It's preparing the pizza right there somewhere. So the beer arrive. Oh, this one it's eight euro. They bring us some water too uh, for the table, and we are uh, waiting for the pizza. Cheers, my darling. Ah. It's very good. It's truly good. The pizza arrive. This is my calzone. My God, look! Look at the size of it. It's huge. And this is uh, Regina, Alina's choice. Looks delicious. Okay, let's try it. Let's see how how is it. Look how much cheese it's inside. My God. This is truly delicious pizza. The traffic here is uh, crazy. Yeah. Those guys have green. Those one is blocking the intersection. Look at this, that this ship is full of people. <laughs> the Flame of Liberty, it's a full-size replica of the flame of the torch from the Statue of Liberty in uh, New York and became an unofficial memorial for Diana, Princess of Wales, after her uh, death in the tunnel beneath. So Princess Diana died right in this tunnel. 